It's a real privilege for me to be on the jury for the third time for the Arc Vision Prize. Um, I, I think it's a prize when it began, it showed great vision. And over the years, I see how it is evolving and getting stronger and stronger. It certainly celebrates quality architecture. It celebrates a diversity of types of roles that women in architecture fulfill, from construction, of course, uh, building wonderful architecture. But we also look at the candidates to see what other contributions they make, perhaps to education, through social service, social programs, uh, through public service, and to the profession. Uh, I think that those are values that I think are very, very important to find. Each person could find their path in architecture and make a very broad contribution to the field. I am Executive Director of the Pritzker Architecture Prize. I also have the privilege to wear another hat at times. Uh, I'm uh, Associate Dean at a small private school of architecture, IE. And in both of those roles, I try to look at what is the contribution and participation of women. Um, I think what we can see is in a profession like architecture, we are behind other professions in terms of giving equal opportunities to women. Sometimes these are historical reasons. It has to do with structural reasons about women entering the profession and staying there. We do see a lot of positive hope in terms of education. At my school and at most schools of architecture, more than 50% of the students are women. That's not going to solve the problem in and of its own. We do have to make changes in terms of access to the profession, access to highest positions in industry. Uh, we have to change the perception of clients. And yes, we also have a role to do in terms of prizes. Um, I think that when we look at a prize like the Pritzker, it's been around for over 35 years or about 35 years. And that means it's a prize which is given to people usually when they are quite mature, more towards the end of their career than mid-career. Uh, the jury is evolving over time and I am really confident that in the future the role of women and the position in the Pritzker Prize will become greater, both as jury members and also as winners. On the other hand, uh, it's, it's really great for me to be on the Ital Cimenti jury because I think this is a clear statement. Uh, it's, it's one that is very focused, saying that we cannot afford to lose the talent of women. We must recognize them. We must also open that, uh, open that panorama or open the, our definition of how women practice and what they do in the field, and we have to recognize that. So um, some things change slowly, and some, sometimes it's all right because there are stable values, but other times uh, it's good to push things to try to make them change a little bit quicker. Thank you. Great, thank you. Thank, <laughs> thank you. you very much. Okay, okay.